This video shows how game highlights can be automatically generated from a tennis match using TensorFlow, as well as some of the Google Machine Learning APIs. This tennis match is between Roger Federer and Stan Wawrinka and is about 3 hours and 8 minutes long. Creating a quick 5-minute highlight video of this particular match would typically require someone to sit through the entire match, sift through content, and then create a highlight. There are a few different techniques that can be applied to automatically generate these highlights. Audio intelligence allows us to detect where the volume of the audio is heightened as a result of audience cheers. Video intelligence API from Google provides information on shot detection. Object detection from TensorFlow is also implemented through video intelligence. In addition, Speech API and NLP API detects where there are areas with positive sentiment or negative sentiment, and also look for certain keywords that may indicate frames important for highlights. Take a look at the Audio Intelligence section. When any one of these points is selected, the frame is brought to the corresponding point in the video where, in this case, there's a higher than usual audience volume. Users can now focus solely on these few points and then go back and extract the key pieces for the highlights feed. Video intelligence enables things such as short type to be extracted. This may be where there was a long rally, or when the shot detection returns a very short segment which might indicate an ace. When this point is selected, the video will transfer to the appropriate section to show that it was indeed a very long rally. Object detection is implemented to take the video to the ball on the line reviews. For example, if this point is selected, it will display the section where the umpire is reviewing whether the ball was in or out. These occasions indicate a particular moment that may be worth including in the highlights. Speech API looks at the commentary for keywords and NLP API that looks into the transcribed text and provides insight into the positive or negative sentiments. Again, areas that could be included into highlights. There is a quick overview at the top, and further down, a table provides much more detail. Users generating the highlights can select which points to include and which to exclude from the final highlights. Rather than picking through the entire three-hour video, this will allow users to look at a quick 15 to 20 minutes of highlights generated automatically and then finalize their own more selective highlight feed. For more information, please contact us at info at